Oh. Okay. <laughs> so we're talking Friday now. Friday is a whole bunch of things, but it can be wrapped up into two phrases. Tie up loose ends and date night. Not so fun. Very fun. Okay, so let's get through this. Tying up loose ends means basically anything that you've put off throughout the week that you need to get done before Saturday. Okay? Those are tie up loose ends. Um, phone calls, paperwork, um, bank, post office, anything like that. Um, then we're looking at also depositing the checks, unless of course, you know, like almost everybody does direct deposit, uh, mailing in bills or setting up the bill pay, filing any paperwork. If you don't do that with the weekly home blessing. Um, and then I also like to throw in like a quick five minute pickup put away in each room, but that's just me. That's not necessary. That's just me. Um, and Fly Lady also adds on here, uh, taking care of your person card today. Like I said yesterday, I do that with, or on the other video, I do that with Aaron Day because I'm already in my car. So if I'm in my car, I'm thinking about it. So I might as well take care of it. But you can easily do it today. So, and then date night. Yes, some of us don't have significant others. Some of us significant others work. You can have a date by yourself. You can have a date with your kids. You can have a date by yourself even if you have a significant other. Socialization, going out, having fun is essential. So, Jasek and I have date night every Friday night. We enjoy it. We watch movies. We'll do Nerf Wars. Um, now that I got a bicycle, we'll go biking. Um, maybe have a picnic. So, um, you know, Fridays are fun. I do the not so fun stuff and then I get to do the fun stuff. Fridays is also generally our takeout fake out where I will make the food of a restaurant we would go to. So <laughs> Wendy's, I would make burgers, chicken nuggets, um, fries, or baked potatoes, um, McDonald's, I would make the fast food fries, you know, cut them really, really skinny and then stick them in my air fryer, burger or chicken nuggets, um, Culver's, he really likes the corn dogs from there, so we'll do corn dogs and fries and fruit and have some ice cream, or we've done Red Lobster, or we've done Taco Bell, we've definitely done Arby's, um, so... It's fun to be able to do it. Of course, you have to enjoy cooking and experimenting in order to do that. But I find it fun. So, but by all means, feel free to go out for date night. You don't have to do it at home. But that is your tie up loose ends and date night. And date night also does not have to be expensive. It can be, like I said, playing cards at home, going for a walk, going for a bike ride, watching a movie, jumping on the trampoline, going swimming, going for a nature walk, um, watching a movie in the woods. Uh, it does not have to be expensive. It does not also have to be extravagant. It can be something very simple. Now, if you have more than one kid or more than one member of the family, maybe have them all put in five suggestions for date night throw them all in a jar and then we just pick at random. So there you go. There's some ideas for date night. Have fun with this and I will talk to you guys later.